All right, so here is the remote and here is my talon. Let me go ahead and drop this real quick and show you why I am about to clean my talon. Let's double click. As you see, as it goes down, look at that dirt that is piling up in there. And yeah, that's dirt, but you don't want any rocks or anything like that to get in there and start jamming it up, start making it make a lot of loud squealing noises and things like that. So let's go ahead and get that cleaned up. All right, let's go ahead and get started. As you can see, you can see the dirt that kind of builds up on there. It's kind of caked up on there a little bit. So what we're gonna do is get that off of there today. Clean up both of these talons. This one is pretty much the same way over here. And that does get into that system a little bit. You probably won't be able to see it too well from this direction. But today we're going ahead and get those, gonna go ahead and get those cleaned up. What we will need is a bucket with a washcloth just so we can go ahead and clean those off once we get everything extended out. And we will be using Pledge for lubrication to make sure the system is, um, once it's clean, make sure we get it lubricated and cleaned up so that it does go in and out um, pretty easily. And I will be using Dawn, just regular Dawn dish detergent um, to get the system cleaned up. So we're gonna go ahead and add some water in there and get going on that. With mine, I do not have the tilt brackets. So what I do pretty much each time I do uh, back my boat back in is just take the talons off and lay those right across the top of the boat. That's why I have these towels here on each side so that I don't scratch it up or anything. But that's quick and simple. I just remove, um, we'll just loosen these up. You don't even have to take them all the way off. So just remove these four bolts. You have two on this side and there are two on the other side. Once you get those off, it just slides on and off pretty easily. And you just have some little plastic um, grommets right inside of there you can see those so all you do is just slide those right back in place never been an issue with me um, getting those on and off pretty easy so that's pretty much the setup guys let's go ahead and get these talons um, laid on the top of the boat and then we will go from there As you can see, those come on and off pretty easily, quick and easy. Since I am using the remote in order to deploy um, the talons, I want to make sure I do those one at a time since I do not have the tilt brackets to do that. What I want to do is just go to the remote and press this button right here. And if you're facing the boat, let's see if we can see that. So as you're facing the boat, that arrow will point to the side that you're actually going to be making the adjustments on. So looking at it like this, I know that this is set up for this one on this side because you can see that arrow right up there at the top. It's pointing to that one. If you want it on both of them, you just hit it again and it'll go back to both. If you want to go to the other side, you just tap it one time and then it'll, that's basically how you go from the left and right talon. But I only want them to deploy one at a time. So I will only put it for one to deploy. All right, let's go ahead and keep moving. All right, so I want to hold these while I extend this out so that I can see any dirt and grime that's inside of it. And just so it doesn't fall over, I just want to keep it stabilized until it extends all the way out. Once you have the talent all the way deployed, 
you just want to take the time to go through and just inspect it all the way from the top to the bottom see if there's any scuff marks or any scrapes or anything that may indicate something is stuck in there mine are um, pretty much going in and out uh, pretty easily not making any loud noises or anything out of the ordinary so it's pretty much for me just going through here and removing this dirt trying to spray in there a little bit with the hose that's why I wanted to get that on that jet setting and pretty much mine are still clean nothing too much on here to worry about so let's go ahead and get that cleaned off and lubed up and put back up All right, now that I have it all rinsed off, just gonna go ahead and dry this off before applying the pledge on there for the lubricant. All right, you don't have to really put too much of it on there. Now I will bring these back in just to the fiberglass and then I'll go ahead and lubricate the fiberglass and see how it looks. All right, there you go. Nice and quiet. That's the way you want these talons to perform. Now I will just put the, the um, fiberglass out so I can lubricate the fiberglass and we'll be done.
right, guys, so that's pretty much it. I appreciate you for subscribing to the channel, continuing to support the channel. Make sure you hit the like button and leave any comments or questions down in the comment section. And as always, make sure you read the description. There will be some good information in there and link to other videos that can help you out. All right, guys.